Hi everyone, welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. I am out of town right now, um, but I still wanted to bring you this video. I forgot to film the intro <laughs> when I did the video. Anyways, um, so I hope you like it. It's a She Modern Fall nail look, so let's get started. Okay, so I made a purchase um, from She Modern and I got some red stripes, some red bows. I got some um, winter gloves, the blue, and blue snowflakes. I got some black flowers, and I got an assortment of leaves, and I got them in yellow, I mean, gosh, not yellow, it's orange, red, and I believe this is the matte gold. And Tina surprised me with the rest of the um, set of pigments, which I'm really excited about because I um, I like them. <laughs> Other the ombre pigments. So now I have orange. So I have the whole collection now. I have orange, green, yellow, and each package comes with four. So she also sent me the gold and green translucent fairy dust. I'm excited to use this one too. And then when you order um, pigments or glitters, you get a full sheet and it's random of uh, nail foils. So I got some more Christmas ones. Ooh, I like those. Um, anyway, so I need to complete my order. I got these on sale for 45% off. She was having the 45% off sale and I really, really needed to get these because um, like, I had no winter ones and I needed to get some fall ones too. So anyways, let's get on with the video or the nail art. The polishes I'll be using in this video are all regular polishes and they're from Caption. So I have um, no batteries included and backseat driver. I'll also be using their top and base coat and with um, with water decals or any kind of foil you'll need a water-based top coat. So I have a Born Pretty water-based top coat. So let's get started. Okay so first I'm going to apply um, the base coat to all of my fingers and then I'm going to wait for that to dry. Okay, I'm going to um, use No Batteries Included on my ring finger and thumb. Oh, I really like how this looks. Okay. And I'll be applying Backseat Driver to the rest of my fingers. Okay, now I'm going to put my second coat on. second coat of backseat driver. Okay, now I'm going to add the water-based top coat over the nails that I'm going to be um, using the water decals on. I, I, um, I put them over some kind of regular base coat or top coat or something like that and it it kind of reacted funny so I don't want that to happen this time so I'm just going to cover this polish with the water based top coat and as soon as this dries we'll be good to go okay so now um, I have a piece of plastic right here and I've got the water decals. 
And um, right now they're coming with a clear. Okay, some of them. All right, some of them are coming with a clear plastic over um, the top, and some of them do not. This one does not. So I am going to. Oh yes, here it is. There we go. So it's really on there, really good. So now they're coming with this clear plastic film, and I'm just putting this um, to the side, and I will cover it back up when I'm ready to slip it back in the packaging. I am going to um, cut out this strip to use at a later time. And I'm going to cut out some of these leaves in various sizes. And I'm just going to cut close to the edge because the water decals are on a thin film and I just want to minimize the film that is going to be around the decal. So I'm just going to cut that around the edge. And I'm going to do that with a bunch of them and then I will come back. Okay, so I have the um, little leaves right here. And I just have a little bottle of water right here. And I'm just going to squeeze some little drops of water onto the plastic and drag the um, water decals in. Because you're going to want the back of the water decals um, wet. Now, normally, well, <laughs> when I use water decals, I have um, gel polish on. And I've been um, using the tacky layer to grab hold of the water decals. Um, that's not the case right now. <laughs> because um, there's no tacky layer on your polish. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to use um, foil glue and I'm just going to put a little bit on. And I know I want one of the leaves down here. And then on my thumb. Oops. I'm just brushing a little bit on and um, I'll be waiting for that to dry. They're kind of gloopy. Okay, there we go. So we'll wait for that to dry. And while we're waiting, our little water decals have already slid off the paper. So I'm just going to put them over to one side here. And then I'm going to take a little lint-free wipe. I'm going to blot them dry. There we go. I have a couple over here that I was, um, was trying to see what color <laughs> nail polish they looked good on. So I have a couple that I did earlier. Now, the the foil glue is already dry, so that's pretty awesome. You just need a really thin coat. And I'm going to get a silicone tool. Okay, and I'm going to put them on. So this little gold one, right here, just going to put right down here in the corner. Oops. There we go. Perfect. And then I'm going to use the big orange one. I'm going to put that right here. Yeah, I like the way the glue works on um, this. And then I've got a little red one. Red one, I'm just going to go like this. Perfect. Love how that looks. 
And now I'm going to do the thumb. Now I have three leaves for the thumb. I've got, oops, this one folded over. Okay, I got it on there. And then I have a little orange one. Which I'm going to put here like this. And then I have another small red one. It's going to go down here like this. Perfect. That is our, uh, I think this light color is the perfect for these color foils. And then the gold looks really good on here. The gold wouldn't show up really well on those fingers. So now I'm going to take the um, water based top coat and I'm going to seal in the water decals. And I'm going to do the same on my thumb. If you use regular top coats, some of them can wrinkle the foil. I guess, I guess some of the top coats might have something in it that would eat away at the foil, and the water-based ones do not. Oh. Okay, but don't worry, after, after the water-based top coat dries, then there'll be a layer in between and you can use your regular top coat over. So right now, I'm just gonna add some of the regular top coat to the other nails. And then when the foil nails are dry, I'll add this top coat to those as well. Okay, so now that the water-based top coat is um, dry, I'm going to put the caption top coat over the top. And then I'll come back when this is dry. So here's my finished Manny. I love how this came out. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.